right, so what we're doing today, we're, I'm just gonna start vlogging, vlogging um, things I have that I do daily, I guess. Um, but we're actually gonna go tour the Chickasha Breakdown Ballpark for the Dodgers and look at the different seating of that you can get season seating for. And we're gonna tour that and take pictures of it. Um, so we're just gonna see what the uh, prices are and how that goes. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what we're, what I'm doing today. And you're along for the ride. If you like it, comment, like it, subscribe. Tell me where to go check out next if you want a place to tour it or something. Um, but that's what I'm doing today. So stay tuned. I'm going to the team store right now. How's it going? Years. 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 Okay. So like 89 years type? Like have you been the Red Hawks? Red Hawks, okay. Cool. So I mean I've been here before so I just haven't been here in years, Not like I said. So, yeah. So okay. Well when you did come, when did you sit or where did you sit? Uh normally behind home plate. Okay. Did just, you like those seats? They weren't bad, yeah. Yeah, not bad, so it could be it could be better. I mean any organization, not just sports, just anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Come on in. This is the club. Yeah. <laughs> club so right here we highlight some of the things that we do in we do in the community with our partners at Kim Ray and, and Terrace. One of the absolute fan favorites as far as things in the community with our partners is the Integris Home Run for Life. Okay. You've never been here during the Dodgers game, so you don't know. Um, but we pick five or six Fridays every season where we, Integris actually, picks hmm. somebody in the community that has been through Integris healthcare system and had a life-changing or life-saving experience. Oh, okay. Sometimes it's a little kid who's overcome cancer. Or sometimes nice. it's someone who survived a car accident or a heart attack or something. What happens is they stand at home plate the players from each team will lie in the baseline. Mm -hmm. We hear their story over the intercom. The horn sounds like they hit a home run and they run around. And That's cool. Five. I know, you get chills just thinking about it. So um, it's absolutely one of the favorite things yeah. that we've got here between fans and staff. We love seeing it. So here's where we highlight that along with um, some of our auctioned jerseys. Okay. Those are breast cancer awareness and um, Tornado relief. Oh, okay. Looks very cool. So during the summer, this right here is the coldest spot in the ballpark. Okay. <laughs> very important. I spent a lot of time here. Yeah. Over the last few games of the season. Um, so when you have club seats, you have access to this entire floor. Okay. So you have AC access, private bathrooms, and Seats that aren't obstructed, like in the Legends Lounge. Yeah. You can actually see the game going on. Um, the seats all range from third base around home over to first base. Okay. We highlight all of the. I, I forget to oh, sorry. Out. I'm sorry. And this is news, so I forgot about it. <laughs> <laughs> but um, Oklahoma native baseball players. That's awesome. Okay. Love this part of the hall. 
I don't think even when I went to games, I was came in the buildings. Yeah, see, and most people don't because you have to have a special ticket. So these packages start at nine games as well, just like that Legends line. Okay. But they come with so much more than just AC. <laughs> Uh, we also write your name up on here. So these are all of our 2021 club members. That's awesome. Yeah. It's fun for me to see people that I know up there. Too. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Makes me happy. So on a game night, got these lights on. Actually, I'm going to go turn them on for you real quick. Okay. watching the game from right behind home plate. Yeah. Sitting on a nice comfy couch with a bunch of beers on this table. You're going to get me in trouble. <laughs> so we have a full bar, obviously. Um, the menu, it's discounted from downstairs. So okay. save some money there. But we also have that full buffet, just like in the Legends Lounge. It rotates out nightly. So if you okay. have a game on Thursday and a game on Friday that you got tickets to, you're not going to eat the same food. Okay. Hot dogs are always available. Right. Don't worry. <laughs> I always have a hot dog option underneath the TV there. But the best part is, each seat, each game, comes preloaded with four vouchers to go towards beer, wine, ice cream, or frozen lemonade. Okay. Okay? Even better, you have in-seat wait service. It's included. Oh. So if there's something on the buffet that, or something not on the buffet that you like, like chicken tenders, uh -huh. There is a menu that they give you of just general concessions items. They will bring it to you. It's included in your ticket. And this, how much is this whole like whole little package? I want you to guess. One one game here. Twenty five bucks. Twenty five. Um. Downstairs is twenty nine. Oh. <laughs> Ten. Eight. I don't know. Forty five. Okay. Okay. So. I thought you were gonna go lower on me. No, no, so. no. Because you have all of this included, right? right? So you have an awesome seat behind home plate, in-seat service, four beers, full buffet, and air-conditioned access, private bathrooms. You also, at the end of the season, get the opportunity to participate in club member batting practice down on the field. Nice. We're having that this Thursday, or next Thursday. So that's always great. You can go and, I had one client in 2019, he actually was out in the outfield diving for some of the balls that <laughs> other other members were hitting, and he's the only one to hit a home run, so I felt great. There you go. My client was the one to hit a home run. Yeah. So, um, just, it's so much fun. All right, so we just left the Bricktown Ballpark with the Dodgers. They have some really good package deals. Um, to be honest, the last time I was there was years ago when they were still the Red Hawks. Now that they're the Dodgers, they have upgraded the stadium in many, many different ways. Um, it, it's worth going. Like, I always enjoyed going when I went to the Red Hawks. But, like I said, I haven't been since they were the Dodgers. So now I, I kind of want to start going back because it's always a good time. I like baseball and everything like that. Um, but if you're looking for, like, a date night option or networking options or anything like that the club level is the route to go you have food provided for you you have AC provided for you if you want it in a, in a room you have drinks provided for you uh, you can either sit inside or outside in the seats um, if you don't want the food that's in the that's provided there's a little waiter guy who comes to your seat and will go down to the club or the regular level and get you food and drinks there if you want. Now you can always get up and walk out and go do it yourself, 
but you don't have to. So there's many perks with the club level. Um, and it's good for like just a friend's night out. Like I'm 28 and whatever. The club scene is kind of getting old. Honestly, I'd, yeah, it's getting old. Anyway, um, it's not to say that in a bar every, every now and then or a club isn't still fun, but it's not like what I want to be doing every weekend now. Like, it's time to start venturing out and doing more different things like I used to before I could go to a bar. More ball games, uh, going dancing a little bit more. Yes, it's a, it's a club if you choose to act like it's a club. Um, two step is always a good time. Uh, but you don't have to club it out if you don't want to club it out. Um, it's a nice ballpark, well taken care of, and they're very active in the community, which is awesome. Um, I will provide a couple of the different ways they're provided in the community in this video. It'll just be a slide. I won't pull them up right now because I am obviously driving. Um, but they, they have... Even if you just want to go for a game, they get options just to go to a game. You can come up to, you can buy tickets at the gate. You can call the person who gave me a uh, tour, Sarah Bischoff, I believe is her name. Sorry, Sarah, I forgot what your last name was. I'm not 100% confident, but I will put that, we'll pop that up because she deserves recognition for sure. She's she's a great lady. She actually helps me. Um, redo my resume when she was on leave for having a baby um so she's helped me rewrite my resume she's she did a i reached out to her via her linkedin to set up a review not a review yeah a tour um of the ballpark just to get reacquainted and see what the new prices were and everything like that i i, I was shocked on the different options and what all the options had in them. Uh, I would suggest meeting up with her and allowing her to do a tour and going through her to get uh, a tour set up for you. Um, but Bricktown Ballpark, the Chicken Shea Ballpark, upgraded since it was the Red Hawks. Not to say the Red Hawks were bad or didn't keep it up, but the Dodgers have upgraded it in multiple different ways um there's many different kinds of seating there's different options just go check it out if you have any questions leave a comment below remember to like and subscribe if there's a tour or a place you want me to check out or vlog that day or you have a question and you want me to answer that i'll answer questions i'll vlog it you tell me like subscribe comment below appreciate it guys